Let me demonstrate the performance differences between conventional linear menus and marking menus. For example, I'll do a selection from a linear menu. I'll select Tools, Hammer. I'll do that same selection as fast as I can. And it took me about a second and a half. Now I'll do the same selection with a marking menu. I'll select Tools, followed by Hammer. Let me show you that again. Tools, Hammer. That took me about the same length of time. Now I'll do the same selection with the mark. That took me about three tenths of a second. I'll show you that again, this time drawing the mark fast. That took me about two tenths of a second. So you can see you can get up to a ten times speed up using a marking menu mark over a linear menu. Let me demonstrate the use of gesture recognition and scale independence in marking menus. First, let's look at a typical implementation of radial menus. In this case, a pie style of menu display is used. For example, I'll select Tools, cross the submenu border, and then select Hammer. Let me show you that again. I'll select Tools, and then Hammer. The implementation does not support scale independence. Note, if I do the same movements but at a larger scale, I get the wrong selection or I get no selection. And if I do the the same movements but at a smaller scale, I get a different selection. Now I'll show you the same selection from a marking menu using menu mode. I pop up the menu, select tools, followed by hammer. Note when selecting both menus, my movements are scale independent. I can make large movements or I can make small movements. They both result in the same selection. If the user doesn't wait for the menu to pop up, mark mode is engaged and a gesture recognizer is used. For example, I'll do the same selection with the mark. Note that I can do a small gesture or a large gesture in a very loose and casual way. In contrast with pie menus, I have to carefully control the size of my movement to get the right selection. Also note that flashing menus are much more visually taxing than the stationary ink trail of the mark.